If there were a Mount Rushmore of Saginaw basketball, Lou Dawkins would undoubtedly be among those enshrined in granite. While Dawkins was an exceptional player in his own right, his influence on a generation of basketball players in Saginaw cannot be overstated. His contributions at Saginaw High and throughout the city laid the foundation for many athletes to achieve the same level of success Dawkins himself reached. Born and raised in Saginaw, Dawkins attended Saginaw High School, where from 1986 to 1989, he learned about the game and life under the guidance of legendary coach Marshall Thomas. Lou was the epitome of the type of a defensive player that I would, would have envisioned. And when I say that, he controlled the game. Now, he, for all intents and purposes, he was a scorer, but he just wasn't a shooter but he controlled the game from a defensive perspective. During his time in the black and gold, the 6'5 forward scored over 1,000 points, earning first team all Saginaw Valley League honors in both his junior and senior years. In his senior season in 1989, Dawkins was named Saginaw Valley League MVP and first team All-State. In one game that season, he tied the single game scoring record held by fellow Saginaw County Sports Hall of Fame inductee, Ernie Thompson. When you think about Saginaw basketball, uh, it, it's Lou Dawkins, uh, wrapped in one. You know, he hard-nosed, defensive-minded. Um, he, he was a little bit unorthodox, but smooth at the same time. You know, he was a very smooth player. Dawkins finished sixth in Michigan's Mr. Basketball voting and his accomplishments earned him a scholarship to the University of Tulsa, where he played under the renowned coach Tubby Smith. At Tulsa, Dawkins played a significant role over 122 career games, with his standout season being his senior year. As team captain in 1993 and 94, he averaged 12 and a half points, 5.7 rebounds, recorded 53 steals, and dished out 138 assists. Before the ending of his first year, he called home and he told his mother that he didn't think Tulsa was the place for him and he wanted to leave. So I called Lou. And when I called him, I gave him that synopsis. Tell him I, if he was going to leave, I would be willing to help him. But I, my first thoughts were that he needed to stay. His defensive prowess earned him the Missouri Valley Defensive Player of the Year Award. That year, he also led Tulsa to the Sweet 16 in the NCAA Tournament, with his most memorable moment coming in a victory over Oklahoma State, where he sank a three-point shot from the corner, one of the most famous plays in Tulsa basketball history. Dawkins graduated with a degree in health, physical education, and recreation and although he tried out for the Phoenix Suns and Detroit Pistons, he eventually returned to Saginaw to begin his coaching career. Dawkins started his coaching journey back at his alma mater, Saginaw High, initially as assistant coach. He instilled a philosophy of strong defense, a family atmosphere, and creative freedom for players on the court. Lou, Lou is, is a motivator. Uh, he's a hard-nosed coach. Um, he, 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 he gets the best out of his kids. He wants the best for his kids on and off the court. Um, he has a big heart um, and he, he's just a motivator for these kids he, and he knows how to develop their talent. After coach Marshall Thomas retired, Dawkins took over as the head coach and led the Trojans to back-to-back -back MHSAA Class A Basketball State Championships in 2007 and 2008. Lou was coaching an AAU team that had both Draymond and Daniel West on it. The next year, the kids were sophomores, and so they, they didn't click right away, but they were, you, you could see them clutching on. By the time they were juniors and seniors, they were state champs. In 2007, he was named the AP National High School Coach of the Year. During his 13-year coaching at Saginaw High, including seven as the varsity boys head coach, Dawkins compiled an impressive 149 to 28 record. Following his success at Saginaw High, Dawkins moved on to become an assistant coach at Northern Illinois University and later at Cleveland State. Currently, he serves as the head coach at Muskogee High School in Oklahoma. Lou met his wife while he was in college 
And no matter what successes that he's had, his greatest success has been the woman that he chose to be his lifelong partner. Dawkins is married to Latricia, and they have five children, Haley, Mario, Christian, Elijah, and Dorian, who passed away and is remembered by the family. Dawkins' legacy as both a player and a coach has left an indelible mark on the Saginaw basketball community.